Welcome back people, we've got some more Fishing Planet for you guys here again today, we are back on iOS. I also play on Steam, on PC and PS4, and max level on both of those accounts, so we do plan to get to max level on iOS. Been playing this game for nearly six years, or well actually I say nearly, for just over six years now, and um, I think this video was probably a good idea to make this one, so you could buy it from level 20, if you've got 94 bait coins, but if not, uh, then the next best option is from level 23 to level 27, the big alloy. Now this is a feeder rod, and this is a very good rod. Now I've had this before, and I've pulled in some big fish with this, like 60 or pound fish, it definitely works. Anytime I do live streams, I'll always use a face camera mic, but the videos I just randomly hit record. That's how we get those awesome clips. So I'm gonna buy that. That's 10,700 cash. That was uh, quite a bit of money, but anyway, we already have the big ally, but not the very best one. Now we have the very best one. We also have this, the Creek Pro. If you're a lot lower level, this is probably a good idea to buy this rod. I'm gonna leave that set up there for a second in case you wanna copy it. That is set out as max drag, so you can put as much tension on it as you want and the line will not snap. Anytime there is updates on Fishing Planet, I'll always let you guys know. I live stream it, face camera, mic showing you new lakes, new hot spots, how and where to catch certain new fish and I'm completing all those new missions. We completed all missions and fish monster missions on Fishing Planet. You could always check those out if you're interested. We also do have a playlist of just Fishing Planet. Couldn't give you a better reason to hit that subscribe button other than that. Right, so the Creek Pro, I'm gonna remove that. Um, actually, no, uh, the big ally, sorry. Let's go to equip. The Creek Pro, uh, I don't know, shall I sell it? Uh, 430 cash. I don't know if I need to sell it just yet. We might do, we'll see. Uh, I probably will actually, because I'm gonna need some line. Okay, so for reels, so we got the weaker setup of the big ally and now we've got the better setup. So that way we've got one of each so we can show you different types of perspective from different levels. All right, so I'm looking for a good strong reel now. Uh, that's 18.7 pound. That's probably gonna be my one, so I'm gonna buy that. There we go, that moved into my home storage. I probably would have wanted that one. That one's 19.8 but I gotta be level 28 for that. So that's why I'm showing you now, because this one's level 27 and this one is level 27. Now we will still be able to max drag it, but I definitely will be going for the fat boy spin 6,000 at some point. That's definitely my go-to reel. <laughs> All right, um, so now we need to equip it. So if we go to our backpack, then you will see, um, is that the equip? I think that's the wrong one. Yeah, that's the that's the weaker one, isn't it? Okay, move to home. Let's go click on our home again. All right, so there you go. Exterminator. Perfect. All right, so now we're going to need some heavy-duty line. Uh, what line do I have? All right, let's remove that. Remove, yes. And then the eight-pound line. We can... Why can I not sell it? Why does it only give me the option to remove it? Normally it gives you the option to, to sell. Anyway, we've got six pound line there and we might as well remove that as well. We ain't gonna need that anymore. All right, so what line do we have? I've got 16 pound line there. If I'm able to, um, don't think I'm gonna be able to buy a better line than that for, for a moment. I am gonna have to sell this rod though. There we go. Um, I don't know. How much is the real worth? 5,600, okay. So now we've got 6,200. Yeah, that was a little, a little bit expensive. But anyway, I'm gonna put on this line here, the 16 pound line, until I'm able to get some better line. That's all I can afford as of right now. So that's what I gotta go for. We also need a weight. I'm pretty sure they're going to be too light, but let's see. Yep, that's too light. Uh, closed feeder. I'm sure that one's too light as well. Oh, okay, no, it's not. That one done the job. All right, then we need a leader to go on there. So I brought these leaders with bait coins. You can buy them with cash as well. So we're going to go to equip. That leader's perfect. 
And then we, oh yeah, I've got some X-Series hooks. Uh, there you go, barbless hooks. Let's move those to the backpack. And then the barbless um, X-Series, move those to the backpack. And then the hash two, move those to the backpack. All right, there we go. All right, in our backpack. Now I'm gonna put on there the X uh, barbless hook. I'm gonna put on there the free up. And then we're gonna to need to buy a bell and we need some bait as well. Running a little bit low on bait. So a bell, we're gonna need a bell. So that's in terminal tackle, I think. Yep, there you go. So there's one bell there. Let's get a different color bell for this one. Yellow, why not? Um, don't know if that went in here or to my backpack. Oh, okay, it was, there it is. Okay, equip. And then this one we can move to our home storage. All right, so there we have it. There's the setup. Now I'm not gonna be able to max drag it as of yet because the line isn't quite strong enough. Um, but anyway, do keep an eye out, make sure you're subscribed. And then that way for the next video, when I hit level 30, you will see me um, having this rod, rod set as max drag. Okay, so that's the level 27 rod. And then we've got this one. So that one's the 1210. So let's have a quick look in rods. And then we go to feeder rods. There we go. So the 1210, the 1210 was level 23. So I've got the level 23 rod and the level 27 rod. So I've got both of those now. I don't know why I even looked around. You can see there's a little backpack there, a little backpack there, so we know. Okay, my plan was to buy this, and then I was gonna head straight back into Florida, into Everglades, to carry on my mission, but I don't quite have enough cash. And I, oh, okay, that's one bait coin. Um, 12 pound line, not really gonna need that anymore. And it gives me 28 cash. Okay, so another thing we can do whilst we're here, we go to premium, go to convert, and then we can exchange our bait coins into cash, as you can see there. But there's not much point in me doing that neither, because that's only 7,300, and I need a little bit more. Um, okay, get rid of that. There's not really anything else that I can actually sell at this point. So I think I'm just gonna have to, I think I'm gonna have to go with it. Yeah, move, move to backpack, yeah. Okay, all right, well, we'll have to go fish somewhere else. So I've got some grasshoppers on me, I think, haven't I? Let's have a look. Uh, where's the grasshoppers? Bait. Okay, that's home storage, that's why. Okay, move that to backpack. Okay, so there you go. All right, yeah, so I've got some grasshoppers, I've got 205. Yeah, I don't quite have enough to get back to Everglaze. That really sucks big time. I'm really close to it, let's see. 7,338, yeah. That's uh, unfortunate, I don't have another bait coin. And I don't really have anything else to sell. So, unfortunately, we're going to have to go into a different lake to do this part of the mission, but that's okay. Uh, x series. what about the jig head? No. Nope. All right, so where should we go? We could move to um, Quenchin. Quenchin's, oh, well, 8,300. I didn't think it would cost that much. Uh, okay, Rocky Lake. All right, I can afford to go there, so let's go there. Okay, buy. There you go. And then we can travel. That's 2,000. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to, unfortunately, show you me in a higher level lake, but um, at least we're showing the rods. So I'm going to try and catch a fish on each rod, and then we can kind of see the difference in how, e how much easier it is which there is quite a difference in it. You wouldn't think it, but there is quite a difference in between both rods, the level 23 rod to the level 27 
Obviously, the level 27 is nine and a half, uh, 19 and a half pound. So there is a little bit of a difference there. So I've got a rod stand as well that I brought from before. So let's put that down there. All right, so I've got to try and make sure that we remember. Okay, so I've got the 1210. So this one's the lower level. This one's the one that's level 23. So we're going to cast this one out there. There we go. We'll place that one down. And then we get out the other one. There we go. Oh, maybe I should change the hook, you know, because the hook probably is a little bit too big for in here. So let's put on the one up hook barbless. we got some interest already. I want to cast this rod out first, though, before I, before I get the other rod. Okay, let's quickly put that one down. Okay, so this one's the level 23 rod. So as you can see, I've got this one maxed out. Uh, the fish isn't big enough for me to show you. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, it, I've got it to the point where it can put on as much strain as possible and it will not snap. So that's the way I've got rod 23, which that is a pretty good setup, to be honest. I think the biggest fish I've landed on there so far is 15 pound. So can hold a good amount. Let's, there you go. I, I don't know. I, I see with the other rod, we're definitely not going to be able to um, use max drag on this one. On the 1410, we're definitely not going to be able to use max drag. But there is quite a few bars there on that reel, so I can definitely adjust it to the point where I can stop it from actually breaking or snapping off or something getting damaged. The thing that cost me quite a bit of money, I earned quite a good amount of cash, but when I left Florida, I had to repair the level 23 rod, then I had to repair the net and repair some other gear. So because of that, that's kind of what left me a bit short. Otherwise, we could have went back to Florida and Everglades. But anyway, these are definitely two rods that I definitely recommend between level 20. Well, as soon as you hit level 23, buy it. And uh, then uh, as soon as you hit level 27, like I have, again, buy the stronger rod, like what we have in our hand here, and go for the fat boy spin um, 6,000 uh, reel. That's probably the best thing. And then for line, get around about 20 pound braid if you can. That's probably your best bet. I hope this video did help you. If you've got any comments, do leave them in the comments section below. I do try my best to respond to every comment. Smack that like button as well if you're still enjoying Fishing Planet. And we'll be back when I'm level 30 on iOS. We catch you people again soon for some more fun and games. I am out.